Hey everybody, it's Shadowstar and Crystal here for more Mario Kart. This time we're moving on to the Flower Cup, starting with Mario Circuit. Alright, it's getting, getting, it, this feels competitive. This feel, last time was actually surprisingly competitive. And it, yet the scores were super close, it was three point difference, and I hit the button if, too well. Yeah, if you'd only had one slight bump difference, there would have been a whole different thing. Wait, so if this is Mario Circuit, what was the, the first track in Mushroom? Was it Mario Stadium? That's what it was. I, I think I mistakenly called it Mario Circuit at one point. Yeah, I know. Back in the day, it used to be a tradition that the game always opened with Luigi Circuit. Oh, yeah. Well, hang on. This, okay, SNES started with Mario Circuit. And like, um, Double si Dash had that one where you go back and forth. And um, so did... Uh, 64 has my uh, Luigi Circuit as the first track. Mm. I believe. Oh, hey, uh, so DS had Figure 8 Circuit. And. Oh, and we had also Luigi Circuit. I had a rough start, but I caught up really well. I can't remember what um, 3DS had. Uh, I don't know, don't care. It's been so long. Uh, yeah, this is going to be interesting. This will be interesting to see how we do, because we're actually very often even now. It really just comes down to what we get shot more. So that's really what, what... I... If I didn't get shot out of the air, things would have been completely different in the last one. Yeah, there's a lot of ifs. Yeah, I know. That's what makes it fun. If one slight thing went different... I think sometimes I hate items. One time, I played every track with no items. Yeah, I know. That's the reason why I hate- it's a, it reminds me of why I hate modern bonus stars in Mario Party. Because I'm like, if it had just- You can't predict them. If, well, it's not so much predicting, it's just, if it had literally picked a different bonus star, somebody else would have won. Yeah, that's what really At least when they're- at least when they're the same three, I'm like, okay, I know that this is how it was always going to be. Yeah. That's why I like, that's, that's the one thing I want to do, we are still going to try the Pro Rules. Where it oh yeah, Pro Rules, at least it tells you what bonus star it's going to be from yeah, the start. Yeah, but it's a different one each time, but it tells you. Apparently bonus rules always locks you into the same turn count. Oh yeah, I think it does as well. That's the one thing I don't like, but otherwise. I wish, rather than actual bonus, I wish Pro Rules weren't like, one big thing, I wish it was like, you could just Choose. Pick and choose which aspects you want. Yeah, because yeah, a lot of I really like a lot of the ideas. Oh yeah, that idea where the shop has limited stock. That is, but that would so work, like there's only two of everything. That would work way better for a um longer game, because then as the game get, game gets on, more and more people are gonna buy the items. Yeah, yeah. But then it gets competitive. I'm like, okay, because then buying items is also you're not just buying it because you want it. You're like, I better buy this now because if I don't, somebody can get it. Mm. That really changes the dynamic of things. We have to try that one day. Yeah. We'll get to it one day, because we've only played the board once. Maybe we'll do it on video, we'll see. Yeah. Maybe. Let's get through Mario Party or let's get through Mario Party or Smash before we move on to Mario Party boards. True. Hard part of Mario Party is like, do we cut it into chunks of a few turns? Because otherwise it'd be like long. Yeah, it, it'd get too long. Well, it's like, um, what did One Away Guys do? It was like four videos to a board or something. Depending on the game, depending on the game, it'd be four or five, depending on game and how long it took. It was always a 20 turn game, though. Yeah, well, if it's 20 turns, you could split it in quarters. Yeah, although it depends which game. It's like, games like Mario Party 1 are faster. Games like Mario Party, the new one, Jamboree, takes about seven years. That's true, and if you get a Jamboree buddy, their minigame takes ages. Oh my ages. god. That takes well, a... actually, it depends which one. Still, one... Even, oh yeah, that DK Rhythm game went on for oh, ages. Oh, fucking hell, that was like worse than the beat goes on. They that... should have just stopped it when it got to the point when I would I would definitely have won. Yeah, at that one point, I just put my control down, like, I don't care anymore. That's the one part of that, it's my, the new bar party, I just... There were so many times I'm like, I'm getting tired of this. It yeah. just kept going on. That's true, some aspects could use some work. I feel like, yeah, that's one thing, like, obviously, I understand gameplay aspects, but like, I feel like some of the animations, if they could just, you know, tighten the animations around a few things, try and speed up any tiny thing to speed up the pace, would be great. 
They even gave this option where you can make the computer players walk faster on their turn. But not like, for why the does that? Yeah, why not the humans? It's just walking. Yeah, I know. Mario Party 3 had that option, and that's for everyone. And I'm really screwing up today. Maybe it's because I'm talking more. Because last time we didn't talk as much, and I did better. Well, then you've got to get better if you. That's the whole point. Mm. Well, I mean, you're in second. You, if you keep. That don't mean shit. That means I'll always have less points than you. Yeah, but we're only in the second race, so theoretically, if I lose the next two races, if you win the next two races. We're at worst time. Whoa. Hold on a minute. No, I screwed up that corner. No, no, no. Closer, closer. It doesn't matter if it's close. That doesn't make the points any different. Well, in terms of overall points, you, you can afford to lose a couple. No, I can't. Not at this point, I can't. I mean, like, over overall, you can afford to lose three. Yeah, and I've lost more than three now. I've lost six. Oh, You're well, winning. Hey, there's still two races. At least we fuck up here and um. Yeah, I need you What's to. What's the next track? I forgot. No, 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 Oh, in the Star Cup. You spend the whole track thinking sunshine's, about it. Sunshine's in the Star Cup. It's killing me. <laughs> I don't care. I see it when I see it. Shouldn't you care? The more I think about it, the more you win. Because now you're winning. Yeah, okay. Tell me. Are you, are you sure it's not Wario? No, Wario's in the... Um, <laughs> No, Warrior, I know for a fact Warrior's Star Cup. It's the op why is the opening of Star Cup? Really? Then what's in this one? That's why I'm confused. Like, this is definitely the second third race. Are you sure it's not, um, the airport? No, airport's Star Cup, that's for sure. That's another word that apparently Americans watching Bluey got confused when wait. they said airport. Wait, 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 wait. What do Americans call an airport? It's, it's the same word, it's just an accent difference. Oh, well that, that's just their own stupidity. That's not even a word difference, they're just being dumb on purpose. I know, but they were like, what the hell, my kids saying airport? As opposed, how, how, how... I don't even know what the opposite is. They were just, they were like, airport, that's weird. Oh, fucking, really good. I need to win this. Well, yes, you need to win this and then... To you even it up, yes. Well, you need to... And then the next one you need to win to also even it up. Never mind, I'm coming fourth. Good. Oh, fucking love them. Oh, good, I didn't fall. I love that they changed they, yeah, they it. Changed you it. don't get shot out of the sky. See, I don't know why you're complaining. I'm in seven. Yeah, how did that happen? A lot of bullshit. Good. Well, that fixes that. Can I at least get slightly ahead? Thank you, thank you. Oh! I jumped straight back into second, at least. Oh! Then I need to win next. If you win next and I come second, we tie. For this cup, yes. Yes. Overall, I still have three points more. Yeah. If I come, But if you win and I come anything other than second... Oh, the shy guy. I knew I was fair getting... This is by... Like I said, the Mario Kart 8 base track suck. Alright. They've got too much blue. What? Oh, yeah. Especially like Dolphin, Dolphin Shoals. Okay. Yeah, this, is, this is intense. There's a lot of possibilities. I could flat out win this, we could tie, or you could win. Mm. Nothing's locked in. See, it's not like we're doing all the tracks in one go. So, like, yeah, when you do all the track in one go, you eventually get to a point where the gap is so high that everyone starts to get locked in. So, if we tie perfectly, who do I give the cup to? I don't know, put it like in the middle. Do it, the grass. That sounds like a huge problem. Put it in the middle or something, I don't know. Yeah, because I made that cool end screen where by the end of this, we're going to have cup symbols scattered on each of our sides. 
Never mind. You being one place ahead of me only works in first because the point difference. Oh yeah, what does third get? Because it's a three point gap between first and second, but it's a two point gap between second and third. Oh, you can beat this little guy. So you have Iggy to come third. Or Lemmy or something. I always get like Iggy, Larry, and Lemmy. If I win, then it's irrelevant. Well, we'll see. Even there, even then though, even if I win and you come second, our overall score won't be huge as a cat. Yeah, I know, but you want to build it up early oh, so you have room to screw up later. Yeah, I know. We'll get more interesting, we're on the easy track. Wait till we get to a lot of the DLC track. Then we won't know what we're doing. I mean, we're playing, it's not like they're blind. True. We're just far less experienced, whereas we've been playing these tracks for a flat out decade. Yeah. Even if that idiot bumped into my shell. Really close. Really close. Nearly hit a banana. Ah, I hit one of your bananas. I think that just saved you. Bluey! We were just talking about that. I love you, Bluey! The symptoms I'll never say. <laughs> it's not a bad show. No! No, don't come forth! Oh no, my mushroom! You're still at all that way. This Please thing. come forth. Yeah, me coming forth gave you the game. Oh, thank God. If I... Because if I was in second and you were in third... I would have won by one point. Oh, with the car! We tied the cup! <laughs> we tied the cup! That's okay. That means I'm still three points ahead overall. And no one gets... Vi You're right, because no one gets a victory. All this work and no one gets the victory. I'll split the cup in half. <laughs> I'll edit the picture, cut it in half, and give us half each. Sure. It's just like the end of Battle Frontier when May and Ash split the ribbon. Yeah, I don't think that's a... How is that... Well, it was an unofficial contest, so it's all like they... Okay, then yes, you can do that. Yeah. In an official contest, you one, can't one, two, split four. it. Oh, that's... Because I'm first play player, it's probably showing mm. my score. Also, I stand by my opinion that ribbons should be non-transferable. Because the princess, as Dawn, yes, gave know. the ribbon to Jesse, but you shouldn't be able to do that. Because the ribbons. Well, I stand are by the point that, that if there's only, I stand by the point that if there's only one contest left in a year, it should be a P4 competition. That's true. Princess should not have been allowed to compete as Dawn, because Dawn already had five. For more information on that, go see my Sinnoh Pokemon review way back in the day. Okay. Anyway, uh, we finished this, we tied it, which means next time we are moving on to the Star Cup. Anyway, we will see you next time for more Mario Kart and other things as well. See, see you next time, time guys. guys.